Now, let's proceed sa responsiveness ng ating website. Okay? So, sa ating uh, browser, meron tayong makikita ang icon like this. Uh, merong uh, hope, pag in-over nyo is mabasa nyo toggle device emulation. I-click lang po natin yan. Okay? And then, uh, i-set nyo to sa 320, which is yung pinakamaliit. Alright? And then, <clears throat> uh, itong CSS natin is i-hide muna natin by pressing Ctrl K and Y. Alright? Dito po tayo sa pinakababa. Okay? Dito sa baba ay maglalagay tayo ng uh, media screen script. Okay? Add uh, at media okay only screen and max width is equal to 320px. Okay? Now, <clears throat> lahat po ng ilalagay natin na CSS rules within this uh, uh, statement okay ay ma-adjust sa 320px uh, screen now i-try natin i-fix itong uh, two columns na ito yung ating main at ang ating uh, aside okay div that main okay gagawin natin is float none Okay, then yung ating aside. I think, aside, content, that main. Alright, refresh natin. Okay, so wala na siyang, uh, tawag dyan, uh, float. Alright, so next, ang gagawin natin is, uh, yung ating div.content, na merong uh, back shadow aalisin po natin unset okay so wala na siyang box okay so naging full width na siya and then yung ating content ay gagawin nating uh, 100% width is 100% right refresh so 100% na po siya okay all right fix po muna natin yung another float nating problem itong about me okay deep sharp about okay that about uh, image we have the float none Width auto max width is 100%. Try natin. Okay. So, meron ba siyang problem? Fix natin yan. Okay. So, yung ating content wrapper. Okay. Give that content proper okay max width of that is now 100% width of yung body nyo meron yan zero body natin ang padding is ito ating right so i-image natin dapat sakto na yan content si content meron pang margin margin 0 
nito, alis na gawin natin auto. Okay. So that's it. Alisin natin yung margin niya. Margin is equal to zero. Fresh. So okay na po. <clears throat> And then, yung ating ano, copy na ito. text margin 0, pattern 0, max width, put none, same push natin, so ok na din ok na yung taas, ok na yung baba so ang problema natin is yung ating form so gawin lang natin syang width, width auto ok so mangyari ngayon yan, ganyan sya gawin natin is max width natin is 100% the width natin is like 90% something like that so okay sya and then ano pa ang problema natin itong ating animation ang gagawin lang natin dyan is so 320 adjust natin yung ating size copy ko lang to height delete natin balik tayo dito so Okay. And then Okay, now i-adjust naman natin siya by devices. Okay? So, let's try um, iPad. Okay? This is 768. Copy lang po natin 'yan. Okay, next sa taas. 768 fresh okay so far so good yeah. okay so medyo maliit yan kasi naka 50% pero kapag 100% yan tama naman po yan alright Okay, ito ang ating part which is pwede natin itong uh, remove check natin kung ganyan na sya alright ok naman sa ating 768 okay and then meron pa tayong isa uh, i-clip natin okay so dito ok naman tayo Pag-indip. And then, meron pa. Ano pang device? iPad Pro. Yung iPad Pro. Sa iPad Pro, meron tayong konting problem. Copy natin ito. Try. Okay. So, itong part na to,
at meron pa rin tayong problem so ang web development ay punong puno ng problem <laughs> okay now sa ating uh, tawag dyan ipad dapat alisin natin itong pagtapak okay refresh so okay siya dyan balik natin yun sa ipad Okay. So, pwede rin natin ibalik to sa 768 Okay pa rin sya Alright So iPad Pro So far so good And then Dito ay pwede rin tayo mag adjust Using uh, Responsive Okay. So, yan po yung ating site na responsive na po. All right, mga kadeb, this concludes our lesson 4 basic CSS3. All right? So, I hope meron po kayong natutunan sa ating video series. All right? So, always remember, keep your goal, keep on learning, and always laugh. This is Mo signing up. Bye-bye.